today we'll be doing a something borrowed on I'm um, having issues down in my lap <laughs> on the pure my little pony palette this was a viewer request and I am borrowing it even though this used to be mine I decluttered it to a friend so I borrowed it back from her so I could come up with some looks this look I'm wearing right here is one of the looks they definitely start as usual with more daytime wearable into more complicated nighttime and or colorful as the looks go on there are three looks and i do talk you through each of the looks so without further ado let's get into the first look so this is the first everyday basic look and I've already primed my eyes so we are going in with rarity and setting that primer really quickly and then we are just taking a fluffy brush and generosity right here and putting that all over the lid And then blend it into the crease. Now that we've got that laid down, we're taking a detail brush and honesty right here and putting that on the lash line and the outer V and then flicking that inwards towards the inner corner, just really contouring the eye. And then take a clean fluffy brush and marry those two together. And that can be where you stop a simple basic look um, or you can take a pop of shimmer or color I'll just take laughter right here on your finger and just pop it in the center of the eye for a little brightness And then take that detail brush and take laughter and rarity together and pop that on the inner corner to brighten it up. And on the brow bone. And that is your everyday look with me pure My Little Pony palette. I've already primed and set my eyes with Rarity, and we are going to be doing something a, a little more monochromatic. Well, I guess that last look was monochromatic, um, <laughs> but I was really inspired by some blood sugar palette looks, and I wanted to do something red and pink, so that's what we're going with. We're taking an angled shadow brush into Tempest Shadow, this red right here and just placing it at that angle from your outer corner up to your brow but stop in the crease and fluff it in and then take that down down under the lower lash line then take a clean fluffy brush and blend that out. Dragging the color into the inner corner. And you can even, if you want the color a little more intense, tap it once into Tempest Shadow just so you have a little more pigment on the brush than what you're dragging over.
and then just repeat on the other side. All right, and then we are going to take a small detail brush and the darkest shade Songbird Serenade and just define the eye like we did in the previous look, going around the outer V and lightly dragging it into the crease. Then take your fluffy brush and blend everything together. Then take a glitter glue. I have the NYX glitter glue right here and pack that on the lower inner part of your lid. Then take a shader brush and Twilight Sparkle, this pink right here, and just place that on top of the glitter glue. And I'm just taking the detail brush and some Tempest Shadow, the red shade, and buffing out the edges. And then you're just going to take a mixture of Twilight Sparkle and Rarity on a pencil brush and pop that on your inner corner. And your brow. <laughs> and this is your second look with the Pure My Little Pony palette. A little late for Valentine's Day, but like I said, I was really inspired by all the blood sugar palette looks i had been seeing so I wanted to do something pinky and red because this palette has lots of pinks and a nice matte red. So I've already primed and set my eyes and the last look we're going to be doing is a colorful rainbow look. I'm going to be taking on a fluffy crease brush pinky pie and be very careful with this one because Pinkie Pie, I think, is the most intense matte in the whole palette. And just fluff that into your inner crease. And then taking Tempest Shadow on that fluffy brush and putting that in the center crease area. Blending it into Pinkie Pie. And then taking Magic, which we haven't used, this purple color, and putting that on the outer crease and winging it out and switching brushes because I'm not that controlled with a fluffy crease brush. Um, bringing it down to the lower lash line. And then we are going in with concealer and an angled brush and cutting the crease out. So 
also just draw slightly above like I have this fold in my crease and I just draw slightly above it otherwise it'll transfer stop at your outer And now that we got the center of our eye cleaned out, then I'm going to start with Applejack, this gold, and put that on the inner corner. And then I'm going to be taking Rainbow Dash, this blue, onto the center of the lid. Then I'm going to be taking Loyalty, this shimmery green, onto the outer V. I'm just taking this angled shadow brush and intensifying the purple a little bit. <sighs> Sorry I didn't say what I was doing. I was just intensifying all the colors and now I'm blending them out slight degree. We don't want them too diffused because that'll blend away the color, but we want the edges a little less harsh. Then for the inner corner, I am taking Kindness, this bright yellow mixed with Applejack. Mostly Kindness, a little bit of Applejack. that to meet the purple. And on the brow bone, mix laughter and rarity. And I am going to put on some liner and some mascara and I will see you in a second. All right, I have lashes and liner on, and this is the completed rainbow look with the pure My Little Pony palette. I hope you got something out of all three looks. You are definitely able to create more than these three looks with this palette. For example, you could do an everyday look with any of the mattes just using a light hand not just the brown tones or you could do that monochromatic look with any of the other colors like the pinks or the purples or even if you don't mind using shimmers in the crease the greens and you can do the rainbow look like i've said previously with putting the colors in any way and you can even you know instead of a gold use a mint green and there's all sorts of things you can do if you just switch a few colors in and out and you can still follow along with these same tutorials that i did and these same looks that i did and just switch out the colors and have like endless looks because there are so many options with this palette and if you have any requests for any other something borrows definitely leave it down below if I'm able to get my hands on it and borrow it from somebody or even if I have it in my collection already I will more than happily do that for you this one was actually a viewer request so <laughs> I really appreciate that because I did declutter this and my friend who I gave it to loves my little pony but has 
no idea what to do with colorful eyeshadow so I just gave her a ton of fun things to do and I'm really excited to put this video out for her and for the viewer who requested it as well they requested the ColourPop My Little Pony which that is coming soon if you want to see more videos like this definitely hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up <laughs> i still feel weird saying that but apparently you need to remind people it was so much fun hanging out with you guys and i will see you next time bye